going on YouTube. I'm uh, with my homie right here, Luke Dombrowski. He's actually a YouTuber, probably like li literally 20 times bigger than me. But um, we're gonna be doing some fishing today and um, we got some live mullet. We're gonna toss them around, look for hopefully maybe a big snook or redfish, and hopefully tarpon, that's what's number one. Yeah, we're gonna do that. It's a pretty sunny day. It's like, it's actually pretty hot, about 9 a.m. right now. It's probably 90 degrees already. And um, got about a dozen mullet in the bucket and uh, yeah, we're gonna hopefully get it done today, so stay tuned and uh, we're hopefully gonna get a big one. Oh, I see, I see one. He's floating right there, if it, you see that? Yeah. Missed it? Come on, stay on it. Stay on it, he's on it. He's 40. Come on, buddy. There's another one, dude. No, the mullet's still on. But I lost the snook. <laughs> Dang. Dude, we're so close right there. He was probably almost, I don't know if he was 40, but he was pretty dang close to it. You on it? I think there's two. That one right there is different. <laughs> he went back under. Yeah, I know, he's back under there. He'll eat. I think he'll eat. There's another one. He's getting chased, I think. <laughs> I literally called it. I was like, we should just check. We'd never know if we if we don't check. And he's a good one too. The the bigger one is probably like thirty. Big I'm surprised he just didn't whack it. I think maybe because I went over his head a little much. Yeah, we kind of came close to under that guy. Oh my! Is it red? No, it's a tar it's tarpon. Oh, what? Yeah. I don't know where he came from, though. What is that? Is it oh, I see one right here. Oh my god, that's a big one. Yeah. Why do I have to? Like, I got a good. Another one under the dock. Can you skip him? Oh, there's a bunch, there's a bunch. He's on it, he's on it, he's on it. Oh, that's good. Nice, Luke. Oh my God. He's still on there, he's still on there. No. Oh! Ho, ho. He'll probably eat again. The bigger ones. Dude, that, oh, they're on me, they're on me, they're on me. That was, did you see how confusing that was? Yeah. I think I thought he spit it. I was focusing on the big ones. There was one too. Those were nice sitting under there. I was like, I got a good feeling about this dock, of course. There's like six. There's a couple, yeah. They're still under there, probably. Yeah, they're chilling. Dude, that was so confusing. That first one was pretty damn big. Well, mine was small. Yeah, yeah, yours was like five pounds. No, I was bigger than five pounds. Really? Come on. It was the most confusing thing ever, though. I have to refine that. Ooh, tarping on it. Why, dude? I'm pulling it out of the water. Literally pulling the mullet out of the water. That's definitely a good time. This sheep's like right there. It's gonna be not fine. Yeah, in the back. Put a tarpon right there, right there. I don't see him. Point him out again? Right there, at the corner right there. Corner, look, look to the left. See him? Yep, caught him. No way, dude. That was gone. Ugh. That was a perfect. I mean, it was a little high. I probably could have kept it lower. Oh, right here. Oh, one on it, one on it. Nope. Got him that time. Oh, yeah, he dropped it. He's still under it, he's still under it. He's looking for it. He's sitting right here. Are you serious? Dude? There he goes. He's still circling.
All right, let's go around the other side. Holy crap, dude. So you took them. What the hell was that? Was that tarpon that did that? Uh, no, I don't think so. Did you see it? I, I thought it was just a little mullet spooked. No! I give up. <laughs> and the mullet's still alive. I told you, Harvey. Yeah, but he didn't eat. He did? <laughs> yeah, he ate right there. I know, but what I was saying is that it flashed and then went over there. Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't, I didn't see that. I thought I saw a little mullet flick on the surface, and I was like, I think that was a mullet. What is that? It is a trout, or a snook. He got it, I think. I don't, I don't know at this point, dude. <laughs> Throw in there. So I reeled and nothing. He on it again. I'm pretty sure that was a trout. That's. It's the only reason I, because I saw that. I got him. Nice red. What the heck? Oh god. I think I might have to jump in because I don't think I'm making this. Ooh, I'm barely making this. Yeah, I think I might. I think I can get him right here actually. Ugh. This is like as big as the red from earlier. Okay. Horse <laughs> Horse him out of there. Dude, I knew it. Do you think that's the same fish? No way. Okay, out of nowhere, we're hooked into the first fish of the day after I've lost like six or seven, and so has Luke. And uh, I think this is my biggest red in like a super long time. A very long time. Lots of head shakes. This was totally unexpected. I'm gonna loosen the drag a little bit. All right, Luke. <laughs> totally came out of nowhere. We're messing with some tarpon all day today and some snook action and out of nowhere, nice red. This is definitely my biggest red in a long, long time. All right, motor's off. I just got to keep him out of this dock here to the right. Uh-huh. Okay. Bright red too. Bright, super bright red. Uh, I think I got him. He's bigger than 30. Okay. Ooh, he's hooked right in the corner of the whip. It'll clip in there. Come here, girl. Or boy. Oh, the little pin fell out? Yeah. All right, just, just hold it. I don't know where the pin went. That sucks. Oh, it is? What the heck? All right. You good? That is actually my biggest red in a very long time. I'm going to measure him here in a second, but I'm guessing about 32. And um, honestly, all day today, it's been really slow for me and Luke. Just a lot of uh, missed opportunities. And um, out of nowhere, just toss under a dock and Red shows up and decides that he wants to eat him. So After the second, the second eat. After the second eat, right. I, we, I had an eat right before and I thought it was maybe a red fish or a trout. So this fish could have came back and tried to eat it again. So. Go ahead and measure him just to give you guys an idea of how big he is. Tails, it's about pinched at zero, and he's right on 30. Mm, 30 and a half, close. <laughs> All right, there's our red. We're gonna go ahead and just lay him back in here. 
had him out for about a minute, but he should be okay. That's like definitely my biggest red, definitely biggest red on the channel, and I think that's my biggest red in probably one or two years. So we're gonna go ahead and just revive her. Super bright red colors. I don't know why. I have not seen very many big reds around my area, and finally I stuck a good one. Here he goes. Kicking, kicking, kicking. Gonna let him go. All right, finally got it done now. I think it's like three o'clock. We started fishing at uh, 6.30 and uh, finally got the first fish of the day. And uh, you never know, hopefully get in one more, one more big fish and uh, hopefully a tarpon or a snook. So uh, yeah, stay tuned. So I see a decent snook sitting, floating right here. I'm gonna toss like three feet in front. I gotta put it pretty close to him. It's money right, right in front of him. Oh, he got it. All right, give him a second to eat. Give him a second, give him a second, give him a second. Oh, there he is. <laughs> there he is. <sighs> that was super sick. Wasn't as big as I thought he was, but he's about, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's definitely about 23 or 24. All right. That's actually the last small out of the day right there. And a nice snook to end it off. Hopefully I'll be able to touch him. <sighs> Jesus. Shaking. Let me just bring him in right here. Oof. Alright. There's the fish to end off the day for uh, me and Luke. He's about a 24 inch snook. Not a monster. Under slot fish. But totally crank the uh, mullet right there. It's super cool to be able to, you know, just sight cast him and just toss a live mullet in front of them and watch them just crush it. But good looking fish. And uh, yeah, we're going to let her go and uh, probably end the day off on... Uh, this guy right here. All right here he is. We're gonna go ahead and just let him back in the water. Fish actually put up a pretty good fight for how big he is. Oh jeez. Ow. <laughs> I'm trying to release you gently. This fish is fired up. Kicking a little bit now. I can feel kicking, kicking, kicking. And there he goes. All right, big shout out to Luke for uh, coming up here and fishing with me. Uh, it didn't work out the way we wanted to. We both missed a lot of shots. He missed a lot. I missed a lot, but I actually got a little lucky there at the end and nailed two good fish. But go check out Luke. He's like literally 20 times bigger than I am on YouTube. Go check him out. He's got a lot of crazy, crazy stuff on his channel, but some crazy eats, some crazy stuff there. And um, yeah, we'll be right back at it here shortly. And um, yeah, if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And yeah, that's all I got to say for today, guys. I will see you guys in the next video.